In this video, we'll be doing EFT tapping on the feeling of being ugly or unattractive. I'll use those words uh, interchangeably sometimes. If one of them is stronger for you, go ahead and stick with that one. So, side of the hand, even though I'm feeling ugly and unattractive, I choose to love and accept myself anyway. Even though I believe I'm ugly and unattractive, I choose to love and honor myself anyway. Even though I believe I'm ugly and unattractive, when I look at myself, it seems so true to me. And when I compare myself to others, it makes it so obvious. Clearly, I'm unattractive. Clearly, I'm not good looking. And maybe I'm getting behaviors around me that further reinforce that must be true. And it's really painful. So even though I feel ugly and unattractive, I choose to deeply and completely love, honor, and accept myself and my body and my face and everything else about me as best I can. Through the points, I feel ugly, I feel unattractive, and it's not just a feeling to me, it really seems like a fact. I can look at myself and I can put it next to a picture of some celebrity I'm thinking of or someone I think of as obviously good-looking and say, hey, there's the evidence. Clearly, I'm not that. And that's painful. Because there's a lot of things in my life that I might be able to change. Yeah, maybe I can change some aspects of how I look. but not that core sense of what I look like. And that base of how I look, it's just ugly and unattractive. And the way people treat me, I've seen how beautiful people get treated sometimes. The attention they get, the perks they get, and I'm not getting that. So there's so much evidence and so much pain around that. that it just sucks. It seems cruel. And it's frustrating. And I want to allow myself to feel that as much as I don't want to. Allowing myself to process the feelings, however they show up for me. Giving them a chance to move through my body. Giving myself a chance to at least be kind to myself. Stop judging my appearance for a moment and just creating a space to feel what I'm feeling underneath it all. And as I continue to do that, I want to allow myself to have a question. A question about perception. And we don't need to be naive. We know there's some supermodel people looking out there. But as far as an objective truth, yeah, I'm just unattractive. I'm ugly.
Think of all the things you look at every day. Whether it's trees or nature or animals or objects. Some things don't look good to me that other people think are beautiful. Could that be true about me? Have I ever found someone to be beautiful who actually thinks they're unattractive? How much of this is my perception and belief? How much of my belief is impacting my energy? And how much is that energy affecting the perception or feeling of others? And I can notice when I look at things around me that I can sometimes just relax that part of me that compares how things look. I can try it right now. Look at this guy on the screen tapping his face. Look at some part of the background or something in the room. If I start really looking for flaws, if I start judging things the way I judge myself, I can find all sorts of problems. I just don't look at other things that way. So could I allow myself the opportunity to look at myself and look at others with less judgment about appearance, giving it less priority, letting that particular form of focus just relax a bit, letting myself see beyond those details. And if that sounds too airy-fairy, say, just try it. I have evidence that I can look at things without judging their appearance. And maybe other people aren't judging my appearance the way I'm judging my own. And can I just do that for me? Just experimenting with relaxing a bit. I don't need to replace it with telling myself how beautiful I am. Or trying to convince myself of something I might not believe. But I can just relax the whole thing. It's not necessary to have such an opinion of myself. allowing my focus to be more outward. To just be looking at the people and things around me more. And judging less how they look. My world will start to shift. Our culture tells us looks are everything. But I do not have to be defined by that. Culture will tell you that that's all that matters in dating or other aspects. And I choose to see beyond that. That's not as naive as I may think. Allowing myself to connect to something beyond the physical, beyond what things look like. different forms of beauty. And as I shift my perspective, 
and my perception, I may literally start to look different to myself and maybe to others. So just allowing myself to relax. I'm part of nature. I look how I do. It's okay. Allowing myself to accept that. And to experiment with perceiving a different way. All right, take a deep breath. I know that was a little long, and I feel like there's a million other threads I could go with that because it's such a deep thing in the culture. So if that took you any particular place, you want to go further, just let me know, leave a comment. I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Thank you.